Hello, I'm Ben Maracle. Welcome to where Hollywood is taken seriously. Today, I will be reviewing the movie Interstellar, which is directed by Christopher Nolan. Interstellar is about Cooper, a farmer who discovers coordinates that lead him to a secret base. At the base, he meets Professor Brand, who tells Cooper that they have discovered a wormhole. Cooper, Amelia, and Doyle journey out into outer space and through the wormhole. While in the wormhole, they visit two planets. Each planet is different in its own way, and both have the wow factor to them. The movie is mainly about Cooper's adventure in outer space and the relationships between the characters. I can't say much else without ruining the movie. Interstellar shows that Christopher Nolan is one of those very rare directors left in Hollywood that puts their heart and soul into every film that they make. I will be shocked if Christopher Nolan does not receive an Oscar nomination for Best Director because he deserves it. Other than the wonderful acting, especially by Matthew McConaughey, who deserves an Oscar nomination, and the great script writing, what also impressed me was the special effects. They were truly jaw-dropping. The special effects that were used in this film aren't the typical special effects that are used in a summer blockbuster. The reason why is because there is not a lot of computer-generated imagery or CGI. Christopher Nolan prefers to use as little CGI as possible. This is one of the very few movies that does time travel right. The time travel isn't confusing at all. If you enjoy sci-fi films, then you will love this movie. This is a shoe-in to be on my top five best films of 2014. This is just as good as a Steven Spielberg sci-fi film. That is how entertaining this movie is. Interstellar stars Matthew McConaughey, Michael Caine, Anne Hathaway, and two-time Oscar-nominated actress Jessica Chastain. I give Interstellar an A+. Thanks for watching. I hope you keep watching my future reviews. You can like Where Hollywood is Taken Seriously on Facebook. You can also email me at wherehollywoodistakenseriously at gmail.com with your thoughts and opinions on Interstellar. And remember, this is where Hollywood is taken seriously.